This is my review of Future State Aquaman number one. Let's get the easy stuff out of the way. Daniel Semper's art is excellent. And now for the story. The story is about Jackson Hyde. The son of Black Manta, also known as Aqualad from Young Justice, and is now the new Aquaman. His therapist and a girl named Andy, who explore the confluence, a special place where all the oceans across the vast expanse of space are connected. I'm sure at the pitch meeting for a new ongoing Aquaman, this made a little bit more sense. Story arc one, Jackson and Andy meet and are sent on a secret mission by Mira, the Queen of Atlantis. Story arc two, Jackson and Andy find the confluence and now must try to find their way home. Story arc three, the capture and jailbreak of Jackson. Now take approximately 18 issues or a year and a half worth of story ideas and condense them into two issues. And a lot of the why of the story is lost. It doesn't make it bad. It's a bit of a fluffy filler story. And these days, a little fluff is nice. It does introduce us to the extreme powers of Andy Curry, which could be important in the future. But overall, this is an opportunity lost. This could have been more interesting as an interweaving backup story in the main Aquaman line.